What do you mean, Pazak? What, again? This is Ronto, Scrag. What house rule says I have to go first? Yeah, well, I'm still not convinced you aren't cheating. Warning. If you draw another plus minus one card, I will enact assassination protocols. This droid is cleaning me out. Uh, what are you playing? Pazak. Well, I'm playing. It's cheating. Whatever, cheater. Uh, can I play? Sure, but I don't have any more credits to bet, so it's Republic Senate rules. Uh, Republic Senate rules? That's where we waste a lot of time trading cards and trying to win. But ultimately our decisions are of no consequence. Uh. It's like stalemate, except the goal is to pass the time until the audience gets bored and leaves. Alright, get me in. Uh, chosen cards, okay. Get rid of that for this. And get rid of this for that. Turn. Fourteen. We could get to eighteen. Let's try. Seventeen. Okay. Oh, oh no, he's got spot one. Oh, but we can uh nineteen. There we go. You know, it's not like the colony's in danger or anything. Like that. Oh. Natural twenty. Uh, we can do twenty again. Oh, we went all three. Statement: My memory core has suffered some damage. Statement: Yet somehow, a gap in my circuits makes me feel as if I should remember you. Statement. This is all the more important since during my routine inspection of all potential escape routes from this vessel, I made an interesting discovery. Observation. The Nava computer is voice locked. As a consequence, you are now responsible for course corrections and astrogation. Statement. That is indeed a great burden. It also raises many questions. Query. Why would someone lock the Nava computer? Answer. Presumably to hide where one has been. Statement. I believe you've been somewhere. Somewhere you wish to keep hit. Hey, er, T3 just judo chopping the back of HK's neck there. Okay, we're good. Alright, let's go talk about the lightsaber crystal and then we'll talk to everybody in the ship. here you felt it did you not uh, yeah it was sound like a power like the time to hide your presence is coming to a close and you will need to increase your training you are ready your training must increase and there are higher mysteries you must learn but only you must know the path you will take I cannot choose it for you is it battle that stirs you to meet an enemy blade upon blade such is the way of the greatest of Jedi warriors, the Weapon Masters. Or perhaps it is investigating the mysteries of the galaxy, seeking out injustice and harm, and bringing it into the light. Such is the way of the Jedi Watchmen in the time of Ulik Keldroma and Exar Kun. Or perhaps your way lies upon the ancient mysteries, and to teach others the ways of the Force, as I have, the way of the Jedi Masters. Uh, what do we want? Yeah, I think we go Watchmen for this. It is not some great test you require to be what you strive to be. It is only your decision to find that path that matters. From here on, you guide your destiny. But in order to take the next steps, you must face your past and put it to rest. Okay. Oh, I level up. We need two more in Constitution. We also need... Let's go ahead. We'll finish out Intelligence. And we need to put two in Constitution after this. 17, 14, okay, beats, 
can get weapon specialization lightsaber, which would be pretty nice. We do need it. That's two bonus damage to lightsaber. Yeah, we'll go and get that. Beat. Powers. Force camouflage. We won't be using invisibility much. Uh, force waves. Got, gotta go with that one. Energy shield. Okay, talk to her again. You have befriended the seer. Uh, why do you call her the seer? Right, seer. Her species does not see as we do. They perceive the galaxy through the force, and it is how she found you. It is a rare gift squandered on her people. The Sith carry the battle to you, and you spare them. And as we travel, the empty places of this ship are filled. I hope your thoughts in this matter are clear. If you take her on as a servant, know that the Sith meet their end at the hands of their apprentices. It is not something I would wish to happen to you. This one you have saved has other masters. Though blind, she has ties to darkness. Her presence here is a threat to us, to you. Do not underestimate her or her loyalty. Um, I feel like one of these may be good. I, I need to look these up. Um, presence here is a threat. Uh, so either this one or actually, if anyone I don't trust you, should give us an increase in. Uh, Then you are learning. Increasing influence. Then you are learning. I don't think there's one we need for that. Okay. You know why her home world was destroyed. Because it was its time. Perhaps you should ask her. It begs many questions. Her people are not prone to violence, war, or hatred, yet their planet is obliterated, scoured from the face of the galaxy, and all that remains is a Sith. Uh, well, if she sees the force, maybe someone wanted to blind them. The Mandalorians were right to respect you on the field of battle. The Jedi are gone, vanished. Now, an entire planet of force sensitives wiped clean of life. And now this slice of the galaxy is blind. It is no coincidence. The two events are tied. Yes, someone wants to blind the galaxy to the force so they can move freely or strike without warning. I fear you are right. And I fear it may prove more than that. War is a hunger. And there are spirits in the galaxy whose hunger is never satisfied. But there is little to be done about it now. Watch the seer carefully. She may reveal more. I have other questions. Ask, and I will answer. Uh, what about the crystal? That crystal is bonded to you. Through you, it acquires its character and strength. And through it, your power is enhanced. Let me focus on the crystal for a moment. There, now it is fully in tune with you again. Is there something else you wished? Uh, should we ask her again? Can you tell me more about it? That crystal is bonded to you. Should your power in... Okay. Is there something else? Um... I'll be going now. It's influence, and the crystal is now leveled up. How many up. more do we intend to gather to us? This ship is not the galaxy. There is only so much room. Uh, how... Okay, I don't see it on the list. Uh, as many as want to come with us to help us? Then prepare for an army, I think, for it seems many more will come in time. They will follow you because you are a leader. Their kind always needs such, even when the figure deserves no such obedience. What makes you think they obey me? Because I am not blind, that is why. I see what they see, hear their voices when they speak to you, and notice the change when they speak to others. Why are you angry? I know many things, and I know what I am not. I am no leader. 
I speak with a voice that will never move others. I speak with a passion that goes unheard. They obey you because you are a leader, and perhaps something more. Have you noticed what has been happening? Have you felt it in them? No, what? They echo you, either fighting or surrendering to their feelings, their loyalty, their duty. Your mere presence serves as an example to them of something to uphold or something to fight against. Watch them carefully, see their patterns, and recognize the strength in it. Influence can be a weapon, one that you may need before your journey is done. Okay, you have a point, I'll reflect upon this. Good, and then act upon it. It is a powerful tool to motivate others. That was Revan's way, I believe. It was a strength. What do you mean? A discussion, um, perhaps. Okay. Had other questions? Ask, and I will answer. What do you know of uh, Viz's master? He, if he can truly be called a man any longer, is one of the dark lords that pursues you. I do not think he knows what you are. Not yet. He spared the Miraluka, and that may have been the last shred of feeling that exists within him. Keep his slave close to you. I suspect there was a reason he spared her, and perhaps a reason that she survived when the rest of her people and the Jedi did not. Uh, he's no longer a man? One cannot have power of that magnitude that her master possesses and still think and perceive the universe as we do, as most of us do. I had hoped that you would not have to confront him, but her presence here has changed all that. You will have to meet him in battle. You must be prepared to sacrifice the blinded one. Perhaps her death will buy you the time you need to deal with her master. Uh, any idea why he spared her? Perhaps he is bound to her, as I am bound to you. If so, there may be a death served by hers. You must be prepared to sacrifice the blinded one. Uh, how did he destroy your homeworld? It is a technique that is almost as old as the Sith themselves. It is a means of severing connections between life, the Force, and feeding upon the death it causes. It cannot be taught. It can only be gained through instinct, through experiencing its effects firsthand. And he used it to kill an entire planet? Yes, and he fed upon its destruction. It will sustain him for a time. How, yeah, how, how can anyone have that kind of power? Power? Do you think so? You would be wrong. There is no strength in the hunger he possesses, and the will behind his power is a primal thing, and it devours him as he devours others. His mere presence kills all around him, slowly feeding him. He is already dead. It is simply a question of how many he kills before he falls. seems impossible. Nothing is impossible with the Force. It is an energy that flows through all living things. And like energy, it may be harnessed, channeled, and consumed at times. It may even be a substance that can burn and ignite. Do not think of his power as one would a weapon, or one of your warships of the Republic. It is terrible, but it is still a subtle thing. The sect of assassins that chase you feed on the Force. What he does is simply the pinnacle of what they could achieve in time. And that is why they and their techniques must be wiped out. No one again must experience and learn what her master did. Uh, how are they able to drain the Force? As much as one may use the Force to bolster the wills and strengths of others, the reverse is possible, though not often used. Instead of sending one's will through connections in the Force, instead such connections are drawn upon, fed upon, and drained completely. But all life is touched by the Force. Then you understand how terrible such a power is, and why it must be ended. It is an empty road to the dark side, and by traveling it, the price is death before one's time. He is a breach in the Force, capable of consuming the lives of those around him. Sometimes the touch is slow, as it is with his crew. How does he use his power? It is not something he can direct or focus, much like hunger itself. He is more of a hole in the Force than a living thing. Force sensitives and worlds rich in the Force draw him. The Miraluka world was one such place. 
That is why where the Jedi gather, Jedi will die. He will feel it, unless they mask their presence. But Qatar called out as a beacon to him, and he could not resist it. And he cares nothing for the Sith, or its teachings, or the Jedi. And when the Jedi are dead, he will feed on the galaxy, the Republic, and eventually consume the Sith as well. There is no future in the empty galaxy he sees, and that is why he must be stopped. The breach must be sealed before his power grows beyond what even we can hope to stop. Okay, I'll be going. Oh, we gained dark side points? What? Why did we say they gained dark side points? Okay. Yes, have you come with questions? I want you to teach me more about the Force. Very well. What is it that drives you? I didn't matter the Force. Ask. Did you know Atris at all? I know her. Ask. Did you know Revan? I miss. Ask. I had Revenant Master to use for. A okay. Alright, I'm not sure how we gain Dark Side points. This sucks. Um. Having you here has an effect on me, General. I never noticed it years ago. I think my mind was too occupied then. I could hear him having a positive effect on you. I feel calm, more in control. The anger is still there, but I can feel it drifting away. The last years of my life have been defined by it. The Mandalorians, Zerka, and Revan. And above all else, myself, for Malachor. What about me? Never, General. It had to be done. My hands destroyed the Mandalorians. I cannot be forgiven for that. Yeah, it, uh, the whole drama could be forgiven. It took you. Even if I did it out of hatred of the Mandalorians? You did it to save us. That might be the truth, but I don't want to see it that way. I can't just ignore the blood on my hands. Uh, you've dwelt in the past for too long. Yeah. Even if there isn't, I still feel like I need to do something to make up for it. Uh, learn the ways of the Force, I can teach you. Under your guidance, I feel like I could overcome my anger. Okay, no time to waste. Cool. Now, Bal Baldur is a Jedi now. He's a guardian, I think. Saver. Let's see, what do we have in there right now? I don't need that. I want this one. Silver, yes. Uh, one wisdom wasn't charisma. One attack and one wisdom. I'm thinking maybe that. Or we just do straight damage. Let's just go for straight damage. We have Beam Gym. Lens, improved deflection, improved. I don't know what that is. Energy cell. Let's see, can we... I didn't. Okay. So we have that. Which is computer use. Demolition is 21. Really? Um... Massive crits. Don't really need... Cells, right? Okay. These are I 
could just add one to three or one to four electrical damage. Right now we just have a two, just flat two. We could go for higher crits. I think we'll keep what we have. The emitters, which one did we have? The deflection one, I think. Was it the regular or was it the improved one? Crap, I don't remember. Chance to stun. Keeps the def minus uh, defense bonus. So does that. Okay, we'll we'll create this then. No, I don't remember. Oh, let's, let's break down some stuff. Uh, what do we have? Lots of this. Break down. Break down anything we have extra of. I feel like the upgrade slots are just not needed. Because they're already high enough level to equip those. Okay, we have enough now. Um, what did we what did we say we want? Deflection. I think that's what we already have. Crap. Yes, we already have the. We need the lens. Just the lens is the only thing we don't have is improved. So. We could do this one. Um, we'll, we'll do this one. Create. Close. Alright, let's upgrade our stuff. For real this time. We want this one. We want just the flat plus two. Improved. Oh, we do have advanced. 25% chance to stun. It's pretty good. But we'll, we'll just keep that. Um, let's see. Talked a little bit more while we're here. Yes, Cycle? is something wrong? Uh, what are you doing? At times, I meditate. Simply close my eyes and listen. It is quite calming. I try to treasure these moments before the next crisis begins. Can you teach me to meditate? Of course. It would be my pleasure. I try to treasure these moments before the next crisis begins. Let's gain max force points increased, and uh, we can now, if we have him in the party, uh, talk to him and cover our force points. My life for yours. I had some questions for you. I will answer what I can. How do you see through the force? If you yeah. wish to know, perhaps it is possible to show another what my people see, what I see. First, you must close your eyes. The surface of the ship, its sights, will only be a distraction. Now, in your mind, reach out. Listen for my breathing. Do not focus on the sound, but the life behind it. Imagine its energy, its texture, in tandem with the breathing, and then in your mind, Step back from the image and see what remains. There. It is not as difficult as I thought. You learn quickly. <laughs> it will take effort to maintain such sight. But you now have that power. And with it, you can use it to see life around you in a different way. As I used to see it. Okay. Oh. Uh, so now, let's see. I think so. Yep. We can do this. And it shows us uh, everybody's uh, force alignment, except for droids, because they are inorganic. So, let's see. Oh. Um, let's go talk to Admin. 
Something up? I have some questions for you. All right. Okay, nothing. There is some dialogue we can do with him, but I need to figure out how to trigger it. Okay, what do we want to take with us? Baldur and the Disciple. not get quite as many uh skill points. Okay, is there anything else that increases like bare fist uh combat? Reflection rolls Okay, that's just skill points. You know what, let's go with the flurry. Go ahead. He now has access to force power, so the first thing is heal. And, you know, we're just gonna do improved heal. Oh. Alright. Powers. Destroy droid. Alright, and what kind of equipment? Everybody's good on equipment. Bonus plus one plus one wisdom, but we have Jedi Master Rage, right? Those don't give wisdom. Um, does give regenerate force points. Okay, keep what you got then. Alright. Oh, we did not make the repair part we needed. You, uh, you listening. are in support. Okay. Yeah. Malfunctioned, repair it. Oh. That is. Are there more traps or anything? I'll talk to them and find out. You'll find little welcome here, Jedi. For your own good, I recommend you speak to Administrator Adari, quickly finish your business in Kunda, and go. Can I ask you some questions? First? I will answer your questions. Be interested in yeah, I guess so. I'm not too fond of my job, but it's better than the job I'd have if the mercs took over. I'll report to Zeron for militia duty. Oh. I think that's everybody. I don't think there's any other named characters. Unless I can talk to the scavengers. Let's let's go run out there and see. I don't think so. But it can't hurt to go check. to see if they'd be willing to help or not. The 
see, did they say anything? I feel much better now, thanks to you. I don't think I thank you properly down there. I was pretty shaken. I really hope the Jedi salvage you bought was worth it. I meant what I said about no returns, though. I need the money to go home. But it's nice to see you again, regardless. Interest in joining the military? I haven't even thought of that. I know the militia will take just about anyone. Oh, we can't... I need the credits and would like working with people who will actually watch your back. Well, I want to think it through, but I think I might just go to Kunda and sign up. Thanks for the idea. Okay. Oh, another one. What about you? Ah, the traveler has returned. I hope the Dantooine is providing suitable distraction and entertainment for you. So, what should we talk about? Enjoying the motion. I uh, have no real desire to put myself in harm's way for Dantooine. They haven't exactly made the salvagers stay here pleasant. Okay. What about you? Jaren says you saved him down there. Next time yeah. you should off. You still lurking around here? Just go back to Kunda. You're not gonna find any Jedi artifacts here. Except the ones I'm selling. You aren't serious, are you? I'll assume it's a joke, because you don't look- Okay. I think that's everybody then. Alright, let's go talk and sing. Because that's all the named characters. I think all the 